Welcome to my life. I make a nigga believe that I'm living in the dream and not reality. Pussy niggas, I will turn. What's good, YouTube? J Man here, bring you another NBA 2K24 build video. Well, not really a build video, but it's gonna be a video that's gonna show you how to hit more threes and three more threes consistently with like a low three ball and stuff. I know it's a lot of people just got the game or a lot of people that had a game that's struggling to shoot um, and that might not even notice, but we just gonna get into it real quick. Um, whatever height or weight or whatever you gonna go with, um, just pick that and I'm finna show you some stuff. So we're just gonna go with some basic. We're just gonna leave it like this for right now. Cause I'm just gonna show you what are the things you need. So like, let's see. All right, say if you like to shoot a lot of open threes or if you're a spot up shooter or something like that, and you wanna use your attributes in other places and you wanna try shooting with a low three or you have a, a, a decent three, but you keep breaking and stuff like that. I'm gonna show you some stuff that you So, with mid-range starting out, look at this. You can put your mid-range to like, what? Let's see, say it's 96. And your potential go to 50 right now, right? So we're gonna reset this and then look at your three ball when you put this up. See, that's already that's already almost 50, and that's at 93. Um, so look, you could do this like okay, the shooting badges and stuff you want. You see the you see blinders, dead eye, you see catch two, you see green machine, guard up, and stuff like that. I'm about to show you something. All right, so let's say if you wanted to try for like a 75 three-pointer, right? Let's go to 75. Look what you get at a 75 three-pointer, right? You get blinders, bronze, you get dead eye bronze, you get catch and shoot, silver, green machine, bronze, guard up, silver, uh, space creator, silver, you get all of these silver and bronze stuff, open look, silver, right? 75. Most, most people will do this and won't even touch their mid-range and nothing like that and then go on about the build and then complain about why they can't shoot and stuff like that. So, I'm finna show you something. So, we're gonna reset this again. Go back to mid-range, right? Let's say if you wanted like Green Machine, Hall of Fame and stuff like that, but you didn't want the high three, right? Look at this. Let's show you how to get Green Machine, Hall of Fame a low three-pointer and a lot of these other bad like gold hall of fame and stuff like that let's see go to 95 right on the range 95 or 95 right look at this even with a 73 pointer look at this you don't get agent threes obvious but just say if you wanted a 75 three ball or you can go to 76 to get agent threes on runs right so you see this you got a 95 midi and a 76 three ball and look at the badges look at the badges you get with a 95 mid-range 76 ball mind you mid range don't cost as much as three pointer but this is the key right here to shoot with a low three ball this year and in previous years to be honest this is the key to shoot with a low three ball this is your mid-range because you're getting some of the same you, you're getting the key badges that you need to shoot threes with you can spot up in the corner. You can literally make a lockdown with like a 73 pointer or 75 three pointer and just a have and just have a, a stupid high mirroring and still knock down consistent. Look at it. You get you get blinders. You get blinders gold. You get dead eye gold. Catch and shoot hall of fame. Green machine hall of fame. Guard up hall of fame. Face creator gold. You get comeback here hall of fame. Midi magician hall of fame. Open looks hall of fame and whistle gold. Like these are key badges that you need to shoot consistent with in this game. So you can have, you can go back to a 70, let's see a 73 ball, right? Go back to a 73 ball and have, and take a 95 mid range, right? And let's just say, put this on 71 for now. You'll hit your free throws if you put your, if you put your uh, free throw meter and make it look. But let's let's just make some basic. Let's say if you wanted to have pass accuracy you know, in your build, let's say let's say about 70, right? Let's just do 70. 
They're gonna make a basic build. I should have made this build 6 2 because it's better at 6. Something like that. Like, let's say if you want this right. On this. Or, yeah, Ink Hall of Fame 93. And let's say you want Harry Irving. Triple style, right? 90. Look at your potential now. Still have a good amount. Still have a good amount of attributes spread around to make it better. Let's say 76, right? For accuracy. Silver or something. Layups are busted in this game. I'm going to tell you this now. You got a small build. Put a 45 standing dunk. You get access to the best uh, standing dunks in the game for uh, shorter heights and stuff like that. All right, I always max out your stamina. So we gonna do that, right? Then you put some strength on here. I'll say like 55 strength so you can get at least gold clamps, right? You're gonna take this up. All you really need is a uh, 80 acceleration, right? I don't even think acceleration matters in the game to be honest with you. So we gonna go like a 80. <clears throat> you can go like 86 right here so you can get the boost gold, right? All right, so let's say if you want gold uh, clamps, right? 93. You still have attribute. Get around with it. You still have attribute. Play up this. Listen to me. Still have attributes to play around with. These YouTubers are telling you to make these bills and you keep remaking bills and remaking bills and you're not gonna have no money or no vc to to actually make the fun bills to get into the fun part of this game not gonna have any vc to make those bills because you keep listening to these youtubers that don't know what they're talking about that's that's selling you a dream so they can get a view i'm gonna look out like literally i shoot like 60 plus percent now from three from all over now since i've known this i kept my day one build for the longest i figured some stuff out got my second build and my second build literally has a 95 mirroring my my second build has a higher three-pointer which is a 92 because i wanted silver limitless but you really don't need I got a 6.8 right now, and I put a lower three ball on my 6.8 Ash, and I got a 95 medium. If y'all want other build videos and stuff like that too, let me know down below. But now you got a you got 93 perimeter defense. You got gold clamps, right? Now let's say if you want to ask, you're not gonna get much steals, but like 71. So let's put this let's put this back down. 93. They, let's say if you're a person that don't even reach game right let's say if you don't even reach if you just want to play perimeter defense look, look, look at this you're six three or six eight wingspan right this is 33 this is cheap this year right 33 right watch this now you got some type of interior defense some people would probably say don't put interior defense but if you're still guarding ball in this all guard you can kind of stop them, right? Kind of stop them. Have a, have a interior defense. Let's see something else. Um, you can even put this up some here. 76, 8, float game Hall of Fame. You get Pro Touch Hall of Fame. You get Scooper Hall of Fame, Silver, Silver, Slithery, Giant Slayer on Hall of Fame. You know, fearless finish. Runs. Look at that. Now you got a high layup. Layups are OP game. Listen to layups are OP in this game. It's back down. <laughs> right? Now let's say if you uh probably like all the thing. Got this 95, right? 91 and I think you need you're gonna need a wait a 83 I need a 93 actually so you will have to take you have to take this down so or you put an 85 and get the clamps on silver right 85 and then 
supposed to be a speed. Two speed. You actually need need to speed more than look. Now you got speed booster hall of fame. And you got hyperdrive hall of fame. Uh you can break a hall of fame. You got gold unpluckable. Look at this. This still a good build. You can still stay in front of the defender. You won't be the main lockdown. Still the defense. So on and so forth, right? 92. And you can add the rest here and get an 88 and then 94 feet. Oh, and you can still you can still guard ball with this too. Like you literally can still guard ball with this. That was on 48. But look at this. 33. Look at this. You can still put the interior up. You can do that. You can do something like this. Put the rest here if you wanted to. But I wouldn't do, I wouldn't do that. I would really just put the rest up here. Or here. If I but I'll leave it like this and probably put the rest. I'm like that. That's a good build as well. But um, this video is just teaching you how to make a field where you can consistently shoot threes and shoot consistently with a low three ball, you know, without wasting attributes, without wasting money and keep remaking bills because you think you can't shoot. Now, that's not everything. But that's just that's just some parts of it. All right, let me go back to because I've been messing around with or that I've made already my. So this uh, right here, let's see. This is my day one build right here. This is my day one build. Wait for air space and slash. Gonna see what I did with this build. How I could have made. This is my day one build. 89 three pointer, 74 midi. I went with a four midi. I thinking to go with the high midi or three ball or three ball like this and go with a higher midi to be able to shoot better. I was shooting, but I was still missing on the field. I was still trying to figure out like, why am I breaking, breaking, aiming jump shots. I was practicing all that stuff. Uh, you see on this build, I got, feel me, I got five ball handle, you know, anyone with ball. Should have went with the 90, 92 speed. So I could get a um, Hall of Fame speed booster, but I defense you need. I went with 93 perimeter defense. Still got gold clamps now. But this build just it wasn't it wasn't clicking like I wanted to for me though. It wasn't but normally like I like I normally do. I wasn't really hitting threes like I normally hit threes. And I wasn't settling for that. So uh, a couple weeks ago, I made my second build, which is shoot first point. See the date, 17, you know, that's when I made this shoot first point. Look at this build right now. You finna see how much better, better this build is compared to my first build. I did. I went 6'2", 193 on the weight, 6'8", wingspan, right? Then you. Look at this. 75 driving layup. This is still good. I still hit my layups like I want to. I got a 65 close shot. Look at this. A 48 standing down. Yes, this build has a 75 post control. 75. So I can do the post phase uh, shots from the mid range and everything. I went with a 95 mid range shot. Look at all these shooting badges. All these shooting badges I get on. Hall of Fame and gold. I went with the 92 three pointer, literally just silver limitless. I could have went with a four three ball and probably put my perimeter up some more or something like that. But I literally did this. Yeah, limit silver, but I don't want to eat limitless though. So. Yeah. All right. What else? Let's see. I went with a 65 pass accuracy. I know I should have went higher pass accuracy. I, I throw the ball fine. I don't really have problems with passing. Don't use fundamental uh, pass style, whatever you not put on fundamental pass style. 
I got a 92 ball handle, 90 speed with ball, 63 interior, 85 perimeter defense. I don't reach, literally, I really don't reach on this game. I get steals from playing hands up defense. Really don't reach it. Unless, unless I get like a void or something like that. Or if I'm on a 86 speed, 80 acceleration, 55 strength for the clamps and just to have some type of strength because most guard builds don't even put strength on the build 60 bird and a 99 stamina. This is my build that I'm cashing out with. The job done. Shoot like 60% from three with this. Like, I shoot good with this. Whatever jump shot you're going to use, practice with that jump shot and stuff like that. Make sure you got the right visual IQ. Go into the Gatorade and shoot, shoot around and stuff. Find you a jumper that you feel like you're hitting with. Use that jump shot. Keep changing jump shots, stuff like that, because you'll never find that jump shot for you. And you to that jump shot, keep changing it for every two games. You actually have to try a jump shot out. You have to actually give it a try. So, um, let's see. I can show y'all my... Uh, I can show you how my 680. Let's see. Here, my 680. This is it right here. Power 4, 68, 249. Man. All right, this is a popper build. Really don't care too much about this stuff right here. This is literally a popper build, and this is how I like to play. How I play the game. This is what I did for my build, 65 close shot, 30 driving layup, 50 driving dunk, really care about that, but I got 90 standing dunk. Vision dunk, aerial wizard, gold, fast switch, silver, rise up. 95, post control, old, unpluckable. You don't have no ball handle or no speed with ball, but I put that post control so I can get that gold unpluckable. I still get back down punch, no offense. Shake Hall of Fame, drop step of Hall of Fame. I get hook specialists, um, hooks, post phase, phenom Hall of Fame. You know, you see all of this stuff. Same thing 95 mid range, eight. I can shoot with a four three ball. I still get all these same shooting 83 ball, only a 83 ball, 74 free throw, and one with a 70 pass accuracy. The passes. In the field. 40 ball handle 40 speed with ball is a couple of there's a couple of moves you can do with this on a bigger build you know blow out dribble that a bucket stuff like that but this is a popper build i really too much don't care on a popper build they're gonna get the job done 77 interior defense i get anchor bronze first gold and post move lockdown run 88 perimeter defense. I still get clamps on this build. Ankle braces. Gold challenger. Challenges open in this game. I got pick dodger. Gold 94 feet. Of course, off ball piss. 85 steals. I can steal. Uh, 77 block. 40 offensive rebound. I went with an 85 defensive rebound. But, uh, I'm expecting to get the job done on offense. Defense, I'm there for my rebounds. <clears throat> I'm gonna get that plus with box out be beast gold and rebound chase of silver pogo. You're still gonna get the rebound of the end court on offense if it uh, comes down to it. You got your badges and come down to it, you position, you box out, you're gonna get it done, especially if you got strength. I went with a 70 speed, 70 speed is good for a bigger build, 68. 99 strength. I don't care what goddamn kind of big man build I make. My big man builds is always going to have 99 strength. It can be a inside big man build. It can be an outside big man build. It can be innocent bystander build. It's going to have a 99 strength. 75 vert and 95 stem. So, yeah, that's going to be like the keys to trying to shoot with um, a low three ball. Focus on that mid range. If you want to shoot with a lower three ball, you can go lower than this. And if you worried about your jump shot requirements and stuff like that, that's what mid range is for too. 
put your mid range up high enough you'll be able to get those jump shot bases and stuff you want according to your height so if you go like under six five you got like six four or shorter and you want curry base and you got like a lower three pointer because you need like a 92 for curry base but if you don't have a 92 three pointer you can have a 92 mid range and still get curry base i'm sorry requirements require you be a certain height have a certain three pointer or a certain mid range to meet the requirements for, the, for that bait i'm sorry so remember that been your boy Jay man you enjoyed this video found it helpful if you make a new build and you put a higher mid range and a lower three pointer come back to this video let me know if it helped you out if i saved you saved you money whatever let me know if y'all want more bills and more health tips and tricks it's Jay man and i